Yep. And then we get what I think is the best of all the beef records. Mm -hmm. Metro Boomin said, well, you done <laughs> pissed me off. Metro Boomin said, you spoke about my, you spoke about my loved ones. And I just, I, and, I, and that just won't do it. You can't speak about my loved ones. And then we get this. BBL Drizzy, BBL Drizzy, with, by the way, he has asked people to write their own Drake, I can't even say it, Drake this. He said, hey, listen, Drake, I can't diss you, but I could do this. Everyone, here's a free beat. Download BBL Drizzy and give me your best verse. And whoever got the best verse, I will give you one of my fly ass beats for free. Yeah. Wow. And people, and people are like, okay. And I'm now fine. everybody on the internet is just dissing Drake. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. I thought this beef couldn't get any better. And then BBL Drizzy comes out and now I'm really dancing. And I'm singing right along with BBL Drizzy. BB. <laughs> BBL. I heard somebody d do a gospel version. Oh, that's fly. Of it. Like, I gotta find just, that. You know, this one I haven't played for my mother. I actually have to play this one because my mom has to. been keeping up with the beef. By way Shout out to Mom Dukes. <laughs> <laughs> she texted me last night. I'm minding my own business. And she texted me last night and she's like, did Drake drop another song? Yes, Mom. <laughs> I yes, said, Mama Dash. Yes, I he said, did. Yeah, and we'll girl, get to that I, in a minute. Yeah, I'll play it for you. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Oh, yeah, but she, I, 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 I think she thinks Kendrick won. Um, her favorite. Oh, Records. The names. Yeah, her favorite one. Euphoria, 616 in LA. 616 in Grants. LA. Okay. She was like, you see, I'm tapping my foot. I said, okay, girl. Well, <laughs> she liked that Al Green? Yeah, she like that's what it was. She was like, I know this beat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I think I told y'all that last week, but she's still on it. She's like, listen, I like this one. I said, okay. And I ain't mad at that. Nah. So we get BBO Drizzy on Saturday. Yeah. Saturday, Sunday. Whatever, man. And it was what accompanied by a series of tweets. Right. You want you wanna you wanna read them? You got them? No, but right. he he comes at Drake. He basically goes, I guess, back into Drake's social media archives and pulls like right. photos of Drake and he's just talking a lot of shit. Um this went on for a while. There's like a series of tweets. Yeah, yeah. Metro Boomer there. was upset and yeah, uh he made sure upset. to say, I'm not even gonna tell people the real reason I don't bang with you because it would be bad for both of us. And that's what's wild to me. This is where it's like, okay, listen. I said, well, now what the hell happened? <laughs> what happened? Right. In the words of my daughter. Right. In the words of my daughter. Just whisper in my ear real quick. What did, what did this guy do? What did Drake do? Oh, well, Drake did a lot of things. Now, I don't know exactly what Drake did, but the answer to right. the question is Drake did a lot of things. Drake, Drake doesn't appear to be a good friend. Um, oh, right. I don't know why. I don't know what he did exactly. Or maybe it is just some egregious shit that he does on his own or with his people that people don't right. want to fuck with. I don't really know. But right. all I know is that Drake did something. You can't have that many people having it out for you right. unless you did something to piss people off. Right. And man, Metro oh. Boomin said, I wasn't even really going to go in on you. No. The drum shit was cool. But now you're getting a little yeah, out of line. I thought it was funny. So I'm going to give away a dope ass beat. And I want to say, man, it's nice to be rich and have resources. Because as an <laughs> artist, away, <laughs> as an artist, I can't even get a, a singer to the studio to save my life. Mm -hmm. If you was like AJD, hey, we're going to kill you. If you don't get an artist to go sing something in the studio tonight, I'd be like, man, just take me now. Because this is where I leave you. <laughs> this is it. I'm going on vacation, y'all. I'll see y'all later. It's over for me. And Metro Boomin got somebody in the studio going in. 
going in with the vocals and he went in with the beat the beat changes a few times there's a section that's just claps <laughs> he went in i said man this is awesome i keep seeing drake has played with talking to women to the women his peers have been with well yeah it's pretty clear that some of the women some some of the people are upset about women but it's not clear what everyone is upset about but it does seem yes josh that most people are upset about something to do with women now he is even saying that on some of his responses he's become a villain even to women with clowning meg the stallion unprovoked yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, this is that was that was weird. He just does really weird shit. Because that whole Meg the Stallion thing just simply did not have to happen. Yeah. There was no like there was no reason for him to do it. I remember when this happened. I remember saying it then. Like, why are you bothering her? Right. Uh, I don't know. Right. 